Hey everybody, it's Big Mayonnaise, back on the sandwich. Now, where we left off last time, we were starting to test out all the dubious grenades. So let's see what else we can get into. But before we get out of here, make sure you guys hit subscribe. Let's go to the tentacle house, which I'm sure is exactly what it means and nothing crazier. Stop dead in your tracks when you see three of those weird fishmen lurking in the mouth lurking in the mouth of an alley up ahead. They're peering around with their glistening, staring eyes and gurb glurbling at each other quietly. One of them notices you. It and its two companions start walking towards you, making wet, growling sounds. Ah, oh, jeez, what? Ah, oh, jeez, what even are you guys, glurb? Well, fish... <clears throat> Well, are you evil invaders, or are you some natives that were displaced by urban development seeking to reclaim what's rightfully yours? The fishmen confer briefly. Evil? Okay, thanks. As long as we're on the same page. <laughs> Perfect! Soda in the hole! You shake the dubious so soda can until the ball starts to rattle. <laughs> <laughs> and then pop the tab and hurl it at the fisherman. It explodes in a spray of sweet carbonated water, which they like, and the glittering aluminum shrapnel, which they don't. <laughs> the confluence of these two conflicting emotions confuses them plenty enough for you to make your escape. Gain 3 XP. Woo! Nice! <laughs> Ooh. Either someone's pet crack and escaped, or someone opened a portal to the waggle dimension. Ugh. Is that what we're calling it? Would you like to leave this betentacled be 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 horror be house behind? No. Seems like the house used to be quite nice. Tall ceilings, nice wallpaper, fancy molding everywhere. Now, however, the wallpaper's peeling, the plaster is crumbling, and there's tentacles poking out of everywhere. It's a real fixer-upper. Hello? Anyone call for a tentacle exterminator? I don't think anyone called for a tentacle exterminator, but... If you'd like to do some pro bono extermination anyway, I also don't think anyone's going to stop you. Well, except for maybe the tentacles. <laughs> well, it's never much for hentai. Get over here! Bow! Get some tentacle! <laughs> you thought you could touch my bunghole? I don't think so. I don't swing that way. Three down, God knows how many to go. <laughs> you gain five XP, 18 meat, and tentacle skin hat band. Ooh, plus one spooky armor to a hat. Excellent. Very excellent indeed, friends. What else we got going on here? Ooh, spooky toilet. This toilet is old and damaged, but appears to still be functional. Flush it. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. The sink is cracked. The sink has a cracked bowl and grubby tape. Give it a prostate exam. Ah, look at that! Somebody lost the ring in the drain, and fortunately your fingers are long enough to grab it. You got a fustulant ring. <laughs> what is that? Okay, so fustulanto. Also reduces targets. Ooh! That's nice! And increases my, my powers. This bathtub's filled with the fluid you'd rather not consider. Consider it fished. <laughs> What'd I get? You got a glob of wet hair. You unclog the drain and the tub empties itself with nauseating gurgle. Uh, this wouldn't- this would be disgusting even if it wasn't what? Reducing enemies- okay, so it's just a combat item. Okay. I don't use combat item much- on uh, items much. I'm pretty strong. What a- what a- Oh, swell, a massive colony of roaches in the walls. This house is a real peach. <laughs> I like how we're going through this whole house as if we're like- Investigating is a prospect for a real estate investment. The stove is remarkably clean on the outside. Check the inside. Ah, yes, all the filth is on the inside. That makes sense, I guess. <laughs> These tentacles must have been in the mood for a snack. Well, I ain't in the mood for nothing. Give them an attack instead. You looking for a snack? How about you eat cheese instead? <laughs> and that's how it's done, boys and girls. You slice them and dice them. You gain 5 XP and 18 meat. And Franklin the Turtle got a little stronger. Delicious. Don't talk about my best friend like that. There's exactly one drawer left intact. A wise person once said that fishing is not a good use of time, but that person probably didn't have as much spare time as you. <laughs> uh, I guess check it, right? Oh, uh, you got a fuse, allows various electrical circuits to work properly, matches. Eh, what about, uh, yeah, I can still fish. Good, good, good. There's almost nothing here to begin with and there's nothing now. There's water here, though, and you have a fishing rod. Surely these things can be used together. <laughs> I do like the uh, the fishing thing here. It's really funny. <clears throat> you find an empty bag nearby that you can use to hold any fish you manage to reel in. Nice, you caught an old orange peel. You toss it in your fish sack. <laughs> you got an item, fish in a sack. Continue fishing. Oh, nice, let's see what else I can get here. 
What do I get? What do I get? Uh, nice, you caught a fish skeleton. You tossed it in your fish sack. <laughs> Let's keep going. What else I got? What else can I get here? A uh, chunk of gristle. <laughs> Looks like you caught everything that was here. <laughs> this refrigerator almost certainly contains horrors beyond your reckoning. Give them to me. Oh no, no horror. Oh no, no horrors. Just some very old food. Nasty leftovers. Three. Ooh, hold on. What'd that say? The spot is all fished out. Try coming back again tomorrow, maybe. Oh, that's cool. I wonder if you can refish areas. What else we got? Doors locked, huh? That's all right. I'm sure we'll find the key upstairs. Ooh. Let's go on door number one. What do we got here? Surprisingly clean wardrobe. Check inside. You got a wire coat hanger. Good for two things. What else we got? Even the second story is infested with tentacles. <laughs> you think you can sleaze me, buddy? Franklin, heal me. <laughs> Once again, these meaty finger boys are no match for the great power that is the big mayonnaise experience you rendered this room very slightly less terrible <laughs> as is my sworn duty <laughs> can't even begin to guess what kind of furniture this was sure i can okay then smarty pants what do you think it was uh a toughet a buffet a footrest give up incorrect guess again shoji screen guess again a bassinet nope wrong guess again a desk wrong Coffee table, incorrect. Was it a kitchen island? Wrong. Was it an armoire? Wrong. A tansu? No. A glider rocket? No. Um, a deck chair? Guess again. A valet? Guess again. What? Oh. Hmm. Let's go. A recliner. A patio table. A table. A hall tree. A piano bench. Card table. A buffet. Console. Tea carts. Headboard. Shelf. Glider rocket. Vitrine. Hassock. A uh, captain's chair. Trundle bed. Hope chest. Bureau. Armchair. Work table. Game table. A uh, writing desk. Ottoman. Lintel. Lounger? Waste baskets. Secretary. Uh, four poster bed. End table. Hmm, cradle. Picnic table. Office chair. Throne. Sleeper sofa. Garden bench. Windsor chair. Futan. Wing chair. Bentwood rocker. Uh, cupboard. Mm, divan. Barstool? What about a flatu? Uh, what about a pew? What about a hat stand? What about a. I, know, I already did all these. Hold on, none of those are right. Holding chair. Bentwood rocker. Director's chair. Uh, armchair. Grandfather clock. A mirror, a punk bed, flows valet, gate leg table, a break front, ladder back chair. <laughs> all right, all right. I told you couldn't guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the nightstand is mercifully tentacle free. Check the drawers. Got an item, jewelry case and tentacle house key for the thing downstairs. Top drawers are filled with dirty handkerchiefs, black, but you find a jewelry box and a key in the bottom one. Very nice, very nice, very nice indeed. This door is barred from the other side. If the bar is anything like the rest of the house, though, it won't take much to break it. Do I have anything that'll give me muscles? No, all right. I, I got three muscle, though. Eh, I don't really want to. I'll have to come back. I don't want to waste my skill points on that. Let's head downstairs. Say hello to the tentacle man. Jeez, it's dark. The cellar is way too dark for you to go any further. Yes, you have a flashlight. But you and I both know that flashlights are only good for making dark places visible, not for making them any less scary. <laughs> That's very true. A full shelf of long-expired cleaning products. Hello, Gabby. Gab with Gabby. How you doing, Gabby? It's all of the berries. Eh. Fuse box, investigate. All the fuses are missing. That explains the lights, I guess, and stuff. Oh. I don't like, I don't like, I don't like. However... I'm gonna have to. Holy dang, what is that thing? Put up thine dukes, motherfucker! Ah. Let's see, okay, so we got one, two, three tentacles. We got a strong tentacle boy. Dancing tentacle is gonna inspire its allies, so we gotta take that thing out quick. Ooh, you thought you could get Franklin with that whiffy little biffy attack? I don't think so. Eat him, mother Ooh, That's not tasty. All right, good, good. Franklin healed himself. That'll give me a chance to retaliate against this ne'er duel. Oh, so close, so close. Almost got him. Almost got him. Franklin, no! Get him, Gabby. Muck him up. <laughs> and now, as they say in my homeland. Oh, he didn't say anything. 
one, one, one. What am I supposed to do here? Come up with my own content? You won. Those tentacles have wiggled their last waggle. And the giant mutant rat, probably in a better place now. You gain 10 XP. You gain 32 meat. Excellent. <laughs> Ooh, seeds. Ah, here's the problem. There's a hole in this bag of tentacle seeds. <laughs> Someone must have, some of them must have fallen in the old dirt floor and sprouted. Clean them up. Got an item, tentacle seed. This company sells these things. Has never done a satisfactory job of explaining why. <laughs> Grow a tentacle to aid you in combat. Nice, I got 11 tentacle seeds. Cool. What about this? This washing machine needs to be washed and repaired and completely replaced. <laughs> See what's inside. You plunge your hands into the foul water left inside the machine and find a pair of nasty old pants, referring to both their condition and their style. Mildewed jeans. Ugh. Oh, I could have fished it. Ah, a shadow rift. Hold on. Let's see. What did I get? They're not bad. They're not bad. I would consider those pants. Let's step through. Well, oh, I hate it here. Oh, that's me. Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't like. I don't like. A piece of eye. Take it back. Oh, this is my nightmare. This is my nightmare. I don't like this. I want to go home. What are you? Why are you in my realm? I am in complete. I must complete. I. Uh, 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 what am I? A, what am I? An Old Testament angel? I don't like this. I don't like this. I want to go home. I want pizza rolls. Mom, can we get McDonald's on the way home, or is it just going to be magic pants again? A throbbing ring of negative energy surround a pair of dark shorts, closing them. With great effort, you manage to drag one, of the, one side of the rift to the other with pliers, only to wrench the whole thing closed. Or ply it closed, I guess. I gained some stuff. Ugh. Hmm. Can I go? Skitter away. Yeah, skitter dadder, let's get at her. That thing from Letterkenny, you know? Hmm. Well, I didn't get the magic pants, so, you know. Oh, hello, Gabby, what's good? What are you writing on that little notebook there, Gabby? Tacticals, look! Gabby holds up the notebook. She's marked the page with a grid and little X's and O's. And arrows pointing this way and that. Gabby's been keeping track on which moves work best for a fight. Jeez, you're getting good at this stuff. Maybe you should be the one giving fighting orders. Ha, ha, Nix, that's your job. Gabby is focusing on Gabby fight stuff and unconcerned with the bigger photograph. Gabby's mysticality increases by one. Okay, cool. I didn't know that she used mysticality. Let's just wander around a bit. Let's, let's finish testing out those things. Um, excuse me there, my good chap. Might you have a match on your person? <laughs> Oh, I love this. Sure, here you go. Yes, but I might need it later. No, lie. I am sorry, no, two lies. No, but also yes. Paradox. <laughs> no, but also yes. Ah, well, thank you all the same. Toodaloo. Toodle off. <laughs> what a weird thing. What a weird encounter. Uh, this would be an unusual sight if you hadn't already seen it before. <laughs> Four Glocklands are playing their Glockenspiels while doing some sort of traditional folk dance. It involves a lot of skipping, hopping, and turning around in a square with precise timing. Let's try to join him again. It does kind of look fun, but you definitely don't know the steps. Ah! What if there's a way I can learn the Glockland dance? <laughs> a little too easy on this one, if I'm being honest. I didn't even get my second turn. Ah, <laughs> uh, nothing new, just a meat. Oh, Franklin got stronger, though. Woo! As you're walking past one of Ocean City's many disused public urinals. Oh, I got the crack rocks again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me the frosty flakes. I like how it's called regular house now that I've taken care of all the tentacles. <laughs> this is a muggery. We invest that you give us all your meat give. What all? What? All of it? That's crazy. I guess that is a little extreme. Say eight meat instead. Nah, nah. I got to test out this last can of cola here. Eco oh! <laughs> But that does mean we have now completed the quest. All right, and now we're out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me all the goodies. Give me all the goodies. Let's go back to Plunkett Street and let's talk to a man about some sodas. Oh. Uh, ah, we already did this. He shuffles away angrily. I wonder if there was something more I could have done with that old man. 
All right, friend. Where shall nods as you approach? Say hello. Hello, how's the grenade project coming along? I threw six. I threw all six of them, and two of them blew up in my face. Hmm, two out of six isn't bad. I think I can still sell them. In exchange for your research, I'll give you a discount from now on. How much of a discount? 200 meat in total savings across all future purchases. Here you go. You gain 200 meat. It seems like less a discount, more of like a flat reward. I just don't like doing arithmetic. <laughs> gain 10 XP. See what's for sale. Do we got anything new? And it looks like all the same stuff. All right, all right, not bad. Um, I think that's all my to-do stuff, right? You side quests? Yeah, I don't have any side quests or anything. Oh, hey, Mayo, before you go to bed, I need you to prove a new tenant for the storefront next door. What? Why is that up to me? Charles shrugged. Somebody's got to do it. There's three applicants for the place. Oh, okay, what are they? First applicant is Jardware's Hardware. I guess if your name is Jardware, your options for rhyming businesses' names are pretty limited. <laughs> <laughs> the second is Truncheons and Bludgeons. This fellow is really excited about weaponry. And the last applicant is Rodkin's Fine Jewelry. A jewelry store could really class up Old Plunkett Street. Hmm. That's a tough one. I think I'm gonna go... We already have a weapon store, though. But I did get that jewelry box, and I'm kind of curious about that. I think everybody else is gonna go with the weapon store or the hardware store, so I'm gonna go with the jewelry store, keep it fresh. Okay, I'll get him moved in next door, the storefront is ready for applicants. Thanks, Charles. Alright, but before I do that, I'm gonna end the episode right here. Thank you guys so much for coming out, thank you guys for checking out the channel. It means a lot to me that you guys are enjoying these series, so make sure you guys hit subscribe. I've been really enjoying this game, and I know a lot of people have already beaten this game, and I know Markiplier started paying, playing it here, so there's gonna be a lot more people coming through. So if you guys are new to the channel, leave a comment, leave a like, you know? Let me know how I'm doing down below. Thank you guys so much for checking it out, and as always, I'll see you in the next video. <laughs>